So this is a YouTuber I found out. Let me be the first to say this. Uh, his name is uh, Crypto John. So Crypto John has been in crypto for quite a while, actually. And he's been saying a lot of crypto, crypto content stuff, um, a lot of great stuff ahead of crypto. And I do agree with him on some aspects. I think I can actually add some value to, to saying what exactly is going on in the next few days in the crypto industry. Seems like crypto right now is definitely growing. It's growing in a good way. Um, it's improving and it's probably going to see future improvement. But there's a lot going to be a lot of new traders that won't realize uh, what you need to know about the crypto industry. Because I've been here for three years uh, and I've been making crypto videos for about three years on and off now. Now I'm back for a long term. Again. And there is something he said about here that I very much agree with. Because I want you guys to be dialed in mentally, physically, spiritually. So crypto is really a mental game. And there's not so many winners as people think. There's actually tons of losers for every of these winners. There's also a lot of losers in that sense. And that's the big problem. There's also going to be like a lot of opportunists in a space. So there are opportunities for sure. You have to change your life forever. You have to want this so bad to do whatever it takes. And listen, the majority of people are going to be greedy, fearful. That's why you see a fear and greed index. Let them do them. Let them wait forever. I said it before, right? An analogy I use from time to time is like we're treading water in the ocean. The majority will stay at the shoreline and watch you. They will watch you, point their finger at you, laugh at you, hate on you, say you're stupid, say a shark is by you, and not make any moves themselves. Let them use that hate. So exactly, there's going to be a lot of toxicity in the crypto Twitter space. And if you're buying a token, there's no really wrong token to buy because the market grows unless you buy like a very low market cap token, which you have to be really careful of. If, if you bought Solana and someone told me you Ethereum is better, cryptos really go up and down. Cryptos go left and right. So there's no really bright picks in that sense like people think, like people expect. And I think this is where the big problem comes in. A lot of people uh, think there's going to be one crypto token that's going to make them millions. And the thing is, most of crypto millionaires, they really didn't know they bought crypto tokens or they were in the industry for like 10 years and made speculative, you know, investments and made tons of profit. It's a reflection of themselves and you just, you're like a robot, you do what you feel was best for you. Exactly. So that's a very fair point in my opinion. This is my mindset. This is how I think. You can't be a winner without having this mindset. This is a growth mindset. Okay. Investing is an emotional game. I said it before. Again, I think a lot of people buy at the very, very high price point and then they get scared when that price point really drops to all time lows like Ethereum goes from 4k to 1k. The biggest mistake people make is selling at like $1,000 for that sense. Like that's the biggest problematic part I s noticed with a lot of these uh, crypto exchanges with a lot of crypto people. But I do think there is going to be like more of massive, massive crypto whales coming in and actually doing some mistakes. Like there were crypto whales doing $1 million mistakes. I'm not like living in my basement like a hermit doing nothing. But I take what's a priority to me and I remember it every day when I wake up. Okay, am I closer to my goal or am I further back? If I'm further back, then why the hell am I not closer? And I try to figure out why. I'm very meticulous with how I act. I always act with intention and purpose. Ask anybody in my friend group. They will tell you. If I don't want something, I will not do it. But if I want something... Get out of my way because I will get it. That's how. So here he actually gives a, a bit of a motivational speech. The issue is, however, is most people, they end up selling their crypto for far less than they could have. And they make actual price losses. They make huge price loss in the long term sense. And I think this is where the real problem arises. Uh, but I do want to say like there are going to be more people actually doing emotional investing, especially traders. I think this make they make this key mistake of doing some 
emotions, trading with emotions, that's the biggest problem. So that's a cool factor uh, in, in a sense, like a, a lot of crypto people are staying here in the long term. Uh, they're really enjoying the time they have right right now. But in the long term, where are you thinking like 2024, 2026? You got to really consider the opportunity that will arise maybe in the future, maybe today, maybe in five days. And I think this is where it will really make that big difference. You will make it. Mark my words, you will make it. You got to believe it first to actually achieve it. I'm not faking it till you make it. Like how I'm talking to you right now is actually how I feel. I am passionate about this stuff. If it isn't showing in this video, then I don't know what to tell you. I am passionate about this. I want to change my life. I want to change my family's life. I want to change your life. The only way I can do that is to instill you guys to come. So yeah, he is very passionate about this one. He has about 13,000 followers. Our spending unnecessary money investing heavy instead of my goal to be financial free and me being people help. Joe, have an amazing Christmas with you and your family. Enjoy this special time. So don't overbuy. I think this is the biggest problem a lot of crypto influencers end up doing is buying more than they can afford to lose. Uh, and then being disappointed really when they bought. So that's one big problem people are doing. So don't do that. Definitely don't overbuy. Uh, that is a key mistake people make. But that being said, there is probably people in crypto that are really going to be emotionally invested all the time. There's going to be tons of, of crypto gains for them. There's going to be tons of massive opportunities. But the way they are right now is just not seeing any of these price price wins they're they're just gonna end up losing everything confidence and belief that you can do this yourself this is what i teach this is what i want you guys to realize you're not lost listen if you're so working yeah there's definitely crypto wins and crypto losses in the long-term sense and the point he's really making with this video i know i might have not said much about this one but the point he's really trying to make with this is stay strong, stay at the top of the game. Realize that sometimes being too much emotionally invested in the crypto markets can really be a big loss and it can really down you mentally. So you can go towards a downward spiral cycle. Um, and I've been in that situation is when you keep checking the prices every day, keep seeing the prices drop every single day. That's where you really got to ask yourself, like, why are you investing in the crypto markets? Are you investing it to be financial free? Are you investing it to spend less money? Investing it because you like crypto. And none of these choices are really wrong choices in that sense. There is uh, everyone can be correct on that matter. So that's where I really think uh, people have the opportunity of a lifetime, really a lifetime to to be here in crypto long term. And I will keep you guys updated if you guys want more content like this. You know what to do. Smash that like button. Uh, there is going to be more videos on, ch on my channel like this one. So if that's something you're interested in, smash that like. Peace, everyone.